welcome and welcome back to another video yes i am here with another video i guess y'all thought i forgot about y'all but i did not if you are a new supporter and you are new here even if you're an old supporter i just want to say that i really appreciate you guys and i appreciate that y'all see something in me that makes you want to subscribe to my channel it makes me feel really good so i appreciate the love and the support from you guys so i'm just here with another video and i just want to say hey to everybody though so i don't i want to forget i don't want to forget to say hi to y'all hi to everyone friends families lovers like <laughs> All right, I'm doing too much. I'm doing too much, but you know, hey to everybody. So in this video, we're going to be getting into my 22. I'm getting it right this time, okay? This is going to be my 22 month sister lock update, okay? I will be 23 months on April 29th. I'm looking at this paper because I had to make, I had to make sure I had everything I want to talk about in this video. I had to make sure I wrote it down because if not, this video is going to be insane. So we're going to get into my 22 month sister lock update on the 29th of April. I will be 23 months, which means I'm coming up on two years. So a lot of you who follow me are some, well, not a lot of you. I want to say some of you are around the same time as me, which is crazy. So I'm glad that we get to watch each, other, each other's journey. Actually, before I even started recording this video, I was watching Renata Monique's channel. Um, hey girl, hey. <laughs> I was watching her channel. Believe it or not, like some of y'all inspired me. Like some of y'all inspired me. Y'all say that I inspire you guys and motivate you guys for whatever reason. I don't know what I be doing, but <laughs> um, it's good to know that I motivate you guys. But some of you who have YouTube channels, y'all actually motivate me too as well. So I was just watching her channel. Her locks are so cute and I liked her content that she just recently uploaded. I believe she uploaded a lot of new videos, so shout out to her. I believe she is around the same time as me, so that is so cool. We're gonna get into some things that's going on with my hair, and then I'm gonna show you guys my hair, some texture shots, and stuff like that, okay? So actually, let me show y'all how my hair is actually looking right now, because I know y'all can already see it. I don't know why my hair is starting to look really um, tight. Like the curls are starting to be more, excuse me, I feel like I got a burp. The curls are starting to be more like defined or whatever. Like my hair is starting to tighten up and they may be a part of the, the locking process. And with that come along a lot of shrinkage. My hair has been I'm out of breath, y'all. Probably because I tried to record this video probably like 15 times, but we're not going to speak on that. But um, my hair is shrinking a lot. Like, it's, it's keep, it, it'll fall for a little bit, and then it'll shrink back up. Fall for a little bit, and then shrink back up. When it gets wet, that's when you can kind of see the length, but it don't take much longer for it to shrink back up after it gets wet. So... I'm gonna try and do a little bit of a length check right now. So this is my hair. Um, and for those of you who don't know, my hair, when I got my locks installed, I started out I started out with nine nine to eleven inches. So most of my hair was eleven inches, but in some places it was probably about nine, nine, ten inches. So we're gonna say I started out with eleven inches of hair. So that is why my hair, you know, at this stage is a little long because my hair was long when I started also um my hair texture and my density is high so I have high density hair and my hair is very textured but you see that so we're gonna get into the bunches since y'all already seen that I'm gonna talk about that next but I'll get, a, get a little length check so this is like bra strap length so y'all see it's it's pretty long 
and that's me standing on my tippy toes um yeah so my hair is pretty long well next i'm going to talk about bunching a lot of the times i have to go in and straighten out my locks very gently straighten them out i don't have any locks i don't think right now that i can actually show you i wish i did but i know y'all can see it like a lot of it a lot of them are just like knotty at the ends which is part of the locking process y'all see this one right i don't know if y'all can see it good my nails is in the way not the pads being in the back it being in the back that's real life but um what is this but yeah a lot of them are knotty um at the end which is just crazy showing the true texture i think this is so cute though how this look at the ends like they look some of them look so pretty look at this on this side is i'm shaking i don't know why probably because of the caffeine but on this side some of them are um straight and um you can, you can kind of see the texture but on this side you can see the texture a lot more y'all see that So that's what I'm dealing with y'all, a lot of bunching. Normally I straighten the bunching out when I'm driving because something about y'all, I don't know if I'm the only one who do this, but I play with my hair more when I'm driving. Um, see, oh my God, y'all heard that? Um, see, oh my God, y'all heard that? That was a perfect example. And y'all see how now it's, uh, it's flattened out. Um, I do try to do this with some sort of, you know, moisture on my hands, on my fingertips, because it is kind of gently pulling the hair apart, basically. But it has to be done unless when my hair completely locks, they're going to lock, they're going to look really weird and fat at the ends. And I don't really want that. I want them to look really uniform. So I do go in probably like every other day and straighten them out. They bunch up really fast too. So that's what I'm dealing with right now. Just a lot of bunching. So what was I saying? So yeah, when I'm driving, I normally straighten them out. Um, I mentioned I mentioned to y'all before, I do love when my hair is being touched. And for some reason, driving and touching my hair to me, to me doing it myself is very therapeutic. I like to drive because sometimes I feel like it's therapeutic for me. It's so strange. So when I do both of them together, it's almost like a self-care moment, if that makes sense. So yeah, that is that on the bunching. We talked about shrinkage, bunching, the settling. They are, I don't know if I mentioned that, but they are settling a lot. Like my hair has so much body and they just dropping and falling, especially when they get, you know, a little bit moisture, you can really see it but um, there's a lot of bounce and body to them. People be so shocked. They like, oh my God. Yeah, there's a lot of bounce to them. Um, I talked about the knots on every lock. Y'all see the texture, we did a lane check. And lastly, I wanna talk about something that, and I want y'all opinions on this, so please feel free to comment down below in the, um, in the comment section but we're going to get into some locks unfortunately that i had to get combined i believe it was two of them um she only told me about one but sometimes it's a miscommunication so i think it might have been more than one um lock that had to get combined to another lock now i know that this is normal it happens a lot of us have combined locks or had to get locks combined but um oh and by the way i meant to mention this during my, I don't know why I'm out of breath, you guys. Um, I meant to mention this in my retightening video. Was it my retightening video? Yes, my re my retightening video, I meant to mention this to you guys, but I forgot. So I had to get some locks combined at my last retightening. And like I was saying, I know that it's normal. We all have locks that are combined but i don't like the way my locks look um 
combined i don't like how when you separate it it's literally two locks that's attached like it's y'all know how it looks i don't gotta get into it it's basically it looks weird it looks weird to me i kind of want her to unattach them or uncombine them and kind of if she can reattach that lock that was almost coming out if that makes sense or yeah that i was going to lose if she can kind of reattach it but I think that she also combined it because it was a weaker lock. It was probably a skinny lock because a lot of these locks in the front and even some in the back. Yo, I am so out of breath. But um, I have some really, really, really skinny locks in the back and I feel like that would be a better example. Okay, perfect. So y'all see this? It's long. Oh, excuse me. It's long, but it's so skinny. Y'all see? So, the lock that she can buy in the front, and I'm not going to be able to find it, and I don't want to waste time trying to find it, because it would be literally an all-day process. But I know it's just, it's, 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 I can't talk. I know it's in the front here somewhere. And, y'all, I did my edges for the video. Not me trying to be real cute for y'all. Yeah, it's it's somewhere in the front. It might be more than one, like I said. So eventually I'm gonna have to recount my locks, but she said that the lock was literally, if I remember, she just said that she had to combine it because I almost lost it. And she said that um, her exact words was, you almost lost the lock, so I had to fix it. So it might've been, like I said, more than one because I seen her doing it. She moved so fast. So I, I felt like she did it more than once. But I'm not exactly sure I would have to go. And it's all in the front right here. So that is about it, y'all. That is about it for this video. I want you guys to talk to me. Talk to me down below in the um, comment section. Let me know anything you want me to know. Also, if you have any questions for me, feel free to ask me down below. What else? We can talk about this topic also if you want to down below in the comment section and it's something else i feel like i want to tell you guys um what else i hope i answer all, all of you questions i know i read the comments and i do try to respond in the comments and then i try to like talk about the things that y'all ask me in the comment section in my videos so i hope i did that for you guys i hope that you appreciate this video i did have to take time out to do this video it was really important to me to get this video out for you guys so i would i, re I would really appreciate it if, if you enjoyed this video please like it because you know us as content creators it's not always easy and i'm realizing that now as a content creator and you know a lot of the other things that i do it's, it's not easy so i really would appreciate if you guys would like this video if that's something that you liked enjoy if you enjoyed the video also subscribe if you are new here and you just clicked on the video if you, you know you want to stick around you want to see what i got going on subscribe um follow me on instagram and like leave comments and um I love y'all. Also, I'll put my cash app down below if you want to support the channel. And I think that's about it. I feel like my mind is, I feel like I forgot something. But if I did, I'll put it down below. I'll pin it. Yeah, that's tell y'all I love y'all. And I appreciate you guys. And thank you so much for being here with me and supporting me and all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Wait, I think that's what I wanted to say to you guys. If you have any video ideas please put that down below in the comment section. Easy stuff, stuff that you seem to enjoy, stuff that is easy for me to do right now. You know what I'm saying? Um, these sit down videos, I do, I'm actually standing up right now in the bathroom as y'all can see, but I like to do sit down videos. I, under, I see that y'all, I was gonna say I understand. <laughs> Talking too fast. I see that you guys like that haul, that panty haul. I was, I'm pleasantly surprised that you guys enjoyed that video. So I would probably have more videos like that coming y'all do like all hauls so i have that coming for y'all y'all like makeup content but if there's something that you think that you're going to enjoy or there's something that you really enjoy that i might did in the past that i haven't been doing put that down below in the comment section 
and that's about it i love you guys so much i hope i haven't talked too fast i hope y'all and y'all understand what i'm saying but i feel like i have so much to say and i don't want the video to be long but i'm done i'm done i'm done <laughs> i love you guys so much thank you so much for watching my video and i'll see you on my next one bye Mwah.